Tesla Semi is expected to dominate the trucking industry after this current uncertain situation ends and the production starts thanks to five simple reasons and one trump card and by trump card i mean a resource nothing related to the united states president Calibel Deveza has published an interesting story discussing these five points in Tesmania.com, which I'm bringing to your attention. Welcome back, dear Torque News subscribers and viewers. Thanks for coming back and watching our reports. This is Armen Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please take a moment and subscribe to our channel. Like this video to show your appreciation of Calibel's work and also the work of all the people who helped me to compile and chronicle Tesla daily at Torque News YouTube channel. And also uh, ring the notification bell when you subscribe so you may be notified because later today i'm going to bring you another interesting story about batteries and about ford starting its production as well as some other tesla interesting stories the tesla semi has the potential to make serious waves and dominate the tracking industry after the dust settles from the global uh, virus situation currently the segment is populated by veterans such as Daimler and its Freightliner brand, Freightliner brand, which accounts for about one in three heavy duty trucks sold in the United States. Yet, despite these challenges, the Tesla Semi has five key advantages and one overlooked Trump card that will allow it to perform very well in the long haul market. The global pandemic has not been kind to the auto industry as a whole, and it has been especially brutal to the long haul tracking market. As noted in a Freight Waves report, orders of new trailers plummeted at 55% in March, primarily due to the effects of the virus. Amid such drastic effects from the virus, there is a good chance that the long haul market will see some changes once the, this virus situation is once this uncertain economic and social situation is over and people get back to normal life among these may be the expedita, expedited emergence of electric trucks which are not dependent on oil and are friendlier to the environment the electric vehicle disruption has not really started in the trucking industry. However, industry leaders like Freightliner have already begun their own battery electric semi program. Freightliner has the e Cascadia, a class A truck, which could rival Tesla semi's long range variant. This means that if Tesla does release the semi sometimes later this year, it would likely set the stage for a battle that would determine the leader in the next generation of tracking. The two biggest players competing for the prize could be Tesla and Daimler's, Daimler's Freightliner brand, currently the king of the tracking industry. Now, I'm going to talk about the battle for the next generation of tracking. Daimler Tracking North American CEO Roger Nielsen noted in the past that his company has a significant advantage in the emerging electric long hauling era. For Nielsen, Daimler's biggest strength will be its experience, which was honed by decades of truck making. We have decades of experience in successful producing durable commercial vehicles in high volumes that stand up to the demands our customers place on them. We now bring this unmatched experience and expertise to the electric truck category, he said. While this is true, the DTNA executive may be neglecting to consider that the stakes are different in the electric truck market. If there is anything proven by the long line of failed Tesla killers that have been hyped in the past, it is the fact that those who mastered the internal combustion engine might not necessarily be masters of the electric motor. Building and designing electric vehicles with industry-leading electric motor and batteries require experience. And in this light, Tesla happens to be the most experienced automaker around. The fight for tomorrow's tracking market will likely involve technologies that are a bit foreign to companies like Daimler and its Freightliner brand. 
these technologies are things that Tesla actually has extensive experience in, thanks to its work starting in 2008 with Roadster up to its current Model Y electric vehicle. Below, I'm going to talk about Tesla's key advantages and I'm going to talk about five key advantages. First, autonomy. Next generation vehicles are expected to feature autonomous capabilities. Even if the trucks themselves are not fully autonomous due to limitations in regulations, next gen trucks are primarily expected to offer advanced driver assist software. This plays right into Tesla's strengths. Take the semi for example. The vehicle is equipped with a dedicated convoy mode that allows multiple trucks to be led by a lead, crewed vehicle. The future may not be a fully blown, full self-driving system per se, but it definitely makes transporting large amounts of goods easier. Such a benefit will not be neglected by business owners, many of whom spend a large portion of their budget on transportation costs. Tesla is working towards level 5 autonomy, which will allow its vehicles to navigate without a driver. Full autonomy would answer the de uh, decreasing number of drivers in the trucking industry. Now, but we need to talk, think about how we're going to put these people to work in other areas so people can continue work and feed their families. There aren't that many people who are applying to be truck drivers today, though. The conditions truck drivers have undergone during the, this uncertain economic situations aren't exactly encouraging people to apply either. Second advantage, batteries. Tesla batteries are industry leading. With auto, uh, with auto experts such as Sandy Monroe stating that they are the best in the field. Tesla's battery technology is advanced enough that its flagship vehicles, the Model S sedan and Model, S, Model X SUV, can draw out far more range than rival vehicles such as the Audi, Audi e-tron from a battery pack almost similar in size. There is a little doubt that Tesla stands today as one of the world's premier battery makers and the company will be bringing all these expertise into the semi. Batteries could ultimately make a difference for the all-electric long hauler as characteristics of its packs such as cell density will likely have a direct impact on the semi's capability and price. The third advantage of Tesla Semi is charging network. Tesla's supercharger network may be second to none, and the planned mega charger system for the semi will likely follow the same ramp. In fact, look at our Torque News earlier report today to see how many Tesla superchargers are in the world as of February as of April 2020. Tesla's proprietary charging system provides rapid charging services that are affordable for vehicle owners. The price of charging could be extremely valuable for the semi-truck since fleet owners will most definitely prefer to recharge their vehicles at the lowest cost possible. Fast charging technologies for the semi were hinted by Elon Musk during the vehicle's unveiling. The Tesla CEO teased short 30-minute charging session for the Class 8 truck, which would add about 400 miles of range. The next Tesla Semi advantage over its competitors is manufacturing scale. Tesla is a young company, but it has a lot of experience in mass producing electric vehicles. With the Model 3 and Model Y, Tesla is attempting to breach the mass market, which requires a production rate that matches the veterans in the auto market. This experience in mass producing electric vehicles will likely be utilized by Tesla for the semi, as hinted at by the all electric trucks Model 3 components. The vehicle, for example, features four Tesla Model 3 de derived motors. Its door handles and twin infotainment displays are also derived from the Model 3. This will likely allow Tesla to ramp the semi's production in a rapid manner, since it will be dealing with parts that have already been in use for years. So this is another huge advantage. And the five the Tesla's business model. 
is the advantage for the semi over the other competitive tracking. At the end of the day, one of Tesla's biggest strengths is its business model, which eliminates the middleman and allows customers to directly purchase their electric vehicles from the company itself. This would likely be invaluable for buyers of the semi, particularly as the vehicle will see a lot of use and abuse on the road. By having a straight line to Tesla, owners of the Tesla will be able to address their concerns to the electric car maker directly. The pricing on the vehicle's parts during their infrequent maintenance will also be fair, as everything will be sourced from Tesla. And in addition of all of these five advantages that Tesla Semi will have from uh, against the other electric truck companies, Tesla's secret trump card is the next one, is the sixth. Beyond all of its advantages, the Tesla Semi has one key trump card against competitors such as Freightliner. Tesla's president of automotive today is Jerome Guillen, a man who has spent the better part of the decade being the electric car maker's resident problem solver. But before he was employed at Tesla, Guyen served as the general manager of new product development in Freightliner LLC. During his stay in Daimler's striking division, the Tesla president actually oversaw the development of a new generation of Class 8 trucks. Guyen's experience in Daimler could be priceless for Tesla, especially since the Semi is his personal project. With this in mind, the Tesla Semi may very well be Tesla's most unex unexpectedly disruptive vehicle yet, since its creator is a veteran of the trucking industry. Well, friends, thanks for listening and watching. Let us know what you think about Tesla Semi's advantages over its competitor Semi trucks in the comment section below. And please like this video to uh, show your appreciation of Caribella de Vezas work who has written this article and published at tesmanian.com and all to also all the people who helped me to compile this information and bring it to you this is armen harian from torquenews.com please uh, subscribe to our channel ring the notification bell because later today i plan to be other interesting tesla and electric car stories to you stay safe take good care of each other god bless you all, and i'll see you in our next report